in Facebook. So I'll give you a second to go ahead and make sure that I get this shared out in all my all of my pages. So you guys just give me a few seconds to get this shared out. First of all, let me first of all, let me make sure that this is actually live. <laughs> and then we're going to make sure that we get this shared out. So give me a few seconds to go ahead and check some things and make sure that Facebook is actually playing nice with me today. Here it is. So we are now live. So give me two seconds to get this shared out as you are coming on. Certainly make sure that you say hi, hello, hey, all that awesome stuff so that we can go ahead and get started. And I see people are messaging like, man, where are you, man, where are you? So let me go ahead. <laughs> let me go ahead and get this shared out right now before we have a revolt on our hands and we don't want that. So let me share it out one more place and then we'll go ahead and rock and roll. Let's see. Let me make sure. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, you guys, come on in. Come on in. Come on into the room. I see some people hopping on in now. Come on into the room. Come on into the room. Come on into the room, you guys. Uh, if you're not able to see it, you guys, first of all, you guys, tag people. Tag people, tag people, because we know it takes Facebook a second to go ahead and start not notifying people that we're on and that we're live. So go ahead and make sure that you tag some people in the comments so that they can go ahead and catch this this particular live so hopefully we should be live everywhere um fingers across fingers across fingers across and so those of you that are new to me if you do not know me i am beverly Wathauer. i am a business strategist for christian female coaches my goal is to help my clients generate more clients in their business so my clients uh within three days of us working together they generate their next four figures and within about 30 days of us working together they generate their five figures in their coaching business. And so let me make sure that I have, here we go. So we should be able to see. So there you go. Hey, you guys, come on in, come on in, come on in. There they go. They're coming in. They're coming in. They're kicking the door down slowly but surely. <laughs> so you guys, once again, this case study, you guys have seen the testimonials that I do. And so this particular case study, good morning, you guys. I see you guys coming on in, come on in, come on in, come on in. Now, you guys do note that I'm using uh, BeLive for this right here, so I'm not um, yeah. I'm not able to see the comments the way that I normally do if I was actually doing this from Facebook. So do note that we do I do see your comments, and I'm going to try my best to make sure that I acknowledge all of you guys. But if I miss you, do note that it is not uh, <laughs> I'm not doing it on purpose. I just want to make sure that I am catching everybody. So I'm going to try my best to acknowledge you guys as I can. But once again, knowing that I may miss some comments. And so you guys, once again, the goal, the goal, the goal, the goal. There we go. Thank you, Sherry. Sherry she's on it. She's on it. She's on it. <laughs> and so you guys, like I said, you've seen the testimonials when it comes to my clients. Those of you that are in my Facebook group, Highly Successful Christian Female Coaches and Consultants. That's a mouthful. Highly Successful Christian Female Coaches and Consultants. You see testimonials in the group on a, day, on a daily basis. And so those of you that know me, those of you that follow me, you know I always say this. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Amanda, for tagging people. Like, I always say this, especially my, my target audience are Christian women. Like, I, I make no uh, apologies for that. That is who I, I'm serving right now in my business because I really want us to know and believe that as believers, as believers, as believers, that we can have successful businesses. And I want you guys to be able to see that on a daily basis. So that's why I share those testimonials on a daily basis so that you guys can clearly see that it can happen. You guys can see the possibilities. And so I decided to grab uh, Sherry today and pull her on today to kind of talk to you guys about her journey and what happened and how she did what she did. Because people are like, oh my gosh, $11,000 in sales in, in four days. When I tell you, Sherry, people were in my inbox like, how did she do that? What did she do? What did she do? So I wanted to bring you on here so they can hear, and I'm not calling you a horse, but straight from the horse's mouth, <laughs> you know, of what it was that you did to get to this space. Um, and so that they can see that when I say it's easy, you know, it, it, it really is easy. Um, and sometimes we just overcomplicate things. And so we, I want to show you how simple it can be. And you guys, of course, like I said, if you are that coach and you're looking for your next five figures in your coaching business, then we need to talk. And that is you. Um, also, those of you, you're like, Bev, my next five figures, Bev, I just want to generate some revenue in my business. I got you as well, because we're going to talk about what Sherry actually did, because Sherry is not one of my one on one clients. So Sherry's actually in my academy. And so my academy is certainly for those of you that are looking to 
you know, generate that like the first five thousand dollars in your business. Like my academy is perfect for that. I, I liken my academy to a library. And so when I say a library, like, you know, it's a specific topic that you have. So say, for instance, you want to know how to have an engaging and profitable Facebook group. Well, there's a class in there for that. So you grab that class off the shelf. If you want to know how to create, you know, five figures using webinars or using uh, master classes, then there's a, a class in there for that. So it's just different little classes. So it's for those people that are self-paced, like you need that self-paced option where you can go in, you know, whenever you need. Oh, OK, I just need a refresher on that. So that's what um, that's what it's about. And that's what it looks like. And that's how, you know, it kind of looks when it comes to the academy. So, like I said, it's certainly for those people at that self-paced option. We have live master classes once a month. So the upcoming math, we have them on the second Monday of every month at 2 p.m. So the second Monday of every month at 2 p.m., we're having a live master class. And so that means this Monday at 2 p.m., we're having our next live master class. And so that master class for those of you that are looking to launch. So I keep getting questions. Bear, do you have a checklist? Like, what are the steps for me when I'm looking to launch a program? And so that's what the live master class on Monday is all about. So what do you do before you launch a program? What do you do during the actual launch? And then what do you do after you have launched the program? Like, how do you do all of that? We're going to talk about pre-sales and upsells, all of that stuff. So once again, if that is something that you desire and you want to know how to do that, then the Academy is for you because we have that live master class on Monday to walk you step by step on how to do that. So like I said, you guys, that's definitely the places, uh, the, the Academy is definitely more of a self pace. But those of you that are like, Bev, I, I, I'm, I'm beyond the self pace in that sense that they need to be able to ask questions in real time when things pop up. Then, yes, I have the one on one opportunities to work with me as well. So that is it. I usually say those are my church announcements. So those are the church announcements because I know you guys are anxious and you're ready to hear, uh, you know, what happened and what, you know, what went on with Sherry. And so first and foremost, we have Miss Sherry Self. <laughs> she is a purpose coach. And once again, she is one of my clients. She's a client in my academy. And so this is the client that you saw spread all, plastered all over my social media page. You know, hey, 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 hey. she, um, she uh, she generated eleven thousand dollars in sales in four days. So she she messaged me first on on Tuesday. We're like, bam! I just sold my five thousand dollar program. And then she messaged me again on Thursday. Like, bam! I just sold two more spots. I'm like, well, Sherry, you do realize that? Hey, if you sell such and such tomorrow, you would have generated five figures in four days. She was like, oh my gosh! <laughs> <laughs> and that's what she did, and she was able to do it. So Sherry, we're going to go ahead and dive right on in here. Um, and so Amanda said, when is that bonus that you posted about on yesterday going to be uploaded? Amanda, let me know which bonus. Let me know which one you're referring to. Let me know which one. Thank you so much, Marsha. And you guys, and I see the comments now, they're starting to come in now, but once again, just know that there's going to be a delay, but we're certainly not ignoring you guys. We're certainly not ignoring you guys. And so you guys, I am done talking on this part. So Sherry, first of all, thank you so much for agreeing to do this case study. How are you? I'm great. I'm fabulous, Beverly. Thank you for having me. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. And so, Sherry, just tell people just, you know, what do you do and who do you serve in your business? Okay. Um, I'm a purpose coach, like Bev said. And what I do is I take women that's in ministry and or business. Um, I'm called to the marketplace. So I take women that's in ministry and those that also that's in business and I help them monetize their their thoughts and I help them launch their ideals and and help them get to a level 10 confidence in the uh, purpose journey. And so, you know, a lot of people are like one of the first questions I ask, you know, where are you? on the scale from 110, 10 being the greatest, where exactly are you with your level of confidence in your purpose journey? And so we're getting shaky. You know, if you don't have at least a eight, if you're not at least an eight, you definitely need a purpose coach. And so, uh, and, and, but I'm called to like, Beverly, I'm clear on who I'm called to. I know who I'm called to. So that was very important uh, uh, three years ago when Beverly and I uh, spoke. Yes, three years ago, I told her, first of all, I told her, I'm not a coach, I'm an evangelist, and this is what I do. <laughs> so, <laughs> so we're like, okay, Sherry, you can call yourself whatever you want to do, but I'm telling you, people are waiting on you. So I've been on the fence, and I've been on the couch for like three years, just coaching for the free. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but because you know how folks are, 
behind the church, Beverly. Like, this is what you're supposed to be doing. This is what God called you to do. So I've been doing it for years for free. And so uh, just really, just got cl uh, uh, just really got clear, got, got some clarity, got to know, like, okay, this is who I am. And uh, I don't know, Beverly got to help me because she know I, I talk a lot. So I could be all yes, so Sherry, Yeah, so Sherry, so you guys, just a couple of things that Sherry said, and I pray that that releases some of you guys. Once again, my people, my target market are believers. And we can get caught up in this trap of, mm -hmm. oh my God, this is a gift that God gave me and mm -hmm. I'm supposed to do this for free. I'm like, you don't go to your job and work for free. You don't do that. <laughs> so... Yeah, so that, like when you said that, you know, and, I, and something else that Sherry said, we're going to get back to that in, in a minute. But you guys, I just hope that you heard what Sherry said. She married, you know, the ministry in the marketplace. Like, you don't have to do that for free. Once again, there is a way that you can monetize on those same gifts that God gave you. Once again, he told you that he gave you the ability to get well. So you guys, let's not get it twisted. Stop twisting scriptures. Let's stop making up stuff about what's not actually there. Like he tells you, he tells you, he tells you, you know, he gives you that ability. He takes pleasure in the prosperity of his service. And so you guys, once again, just knowing how to, a lot of us, we are excellent at what we do, but that business piece, y'all suck. I'm like, I'm good. Y'all know me. Y'all know me. I keep, y'all yeah. suck at that. And that's where I come in. That's where I come in. Cause I'm going to yeah. show you how to monetize on those gifts that God has given you. So that was one thing, like I said, so I pray that that frees some of you guys that are in that whole quandary. Oh my gosh, do I pay? Or when people roll up on you and say, how dare you pay, you know, for what it is that God is giving mm -hmm. you. And like I said, but you go to work every day and you don't go to work for free. So how dare you go and you, you get a paycheck for your, it's the same thing. It's your skills and ability that you're getting paid for at work. So why do you not expect for me to get paid for what it is that I do? So I'm glad that you said that. And you guys, the other thing that Sherry said was she's a purpose coach. Some of you guys run around here saying, oh, my gosh, you have to be a business coach to make money. Oh, my gosh, you have to be a sales coach. Bill, how do I make money as a life coach? Bill, how the stop. You guys, anytime you get that resistance like that, that is nothing but fear. That is so I wanted Sherry to tell you guys what she does. Once again, a purpose coach. And she said, if you are not at you, what you said, a level eight or above, yeah. you need to get with her. <laughs> you need to get with her if you're not walking in your purpose like that. Because you guys, one of the most unfulfilling things, one of the saddest things, is, and I'm talking to believers right now. So if you're not a believer, plug your ears. One of the saddest things is for a believer to get up every single day in this routine that you cannot stand, where you're not happy. You're in this life where you're not happy. God didn't create us to live that way. Point blank, period. That's right. And so if you don't know how to identify that, not only just identify it, right, Sherry, but also walk in it, that's walk where you come in. in. Walk, walk in and own it. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Okay, so Sherry, you said something else that I'm not going to let slide by. Now, Sherry, when did you first reach out to me about, because Sherry and I first met because we were co-authors in a book. So that's how we initially came in contact with one another. But Sherry, how long ago did you first reach out to me when it came to coaching? I think it was right after we launched our book. I think, what was that? Was that 17 or 16? So, yeah, it was like 19, 2017, 2017. Yeah. It, was, it was years ago. It wasn't yesterday. It was not yesterday. And so Sherry, you guys, no. she, she let you know. She reached out to me a, a couple of years. We'll, we'll say two years. Let's say two years ago. And so, Sherry, when you reached out to me two years ago, first of all, she explained, you know, Ben, I don't resonate with that word coach. And I told her, you call yourself whatever you want to call yourself. I, didn't I tell you that? I said, you call I want to call it whatever. Like, I don't want no coach and I don't want nobody following me. I don't want no followers. She, yeah, you guys, when I tell you, that's exactly what Sherry said. She, she said, I don't want no followers. Okay, well, what, I said, Sherry, what do you want to call them? I, like I said, I said, whatever you would call it, your tribe, your community, whatever words you want to use, but people need you. And you guys, once again, as long as you're able to solve a problem as an entrepreneur, people need you. So Sherry, when you came to me, what did you need support with back then? What, what, what did you feel like? What did you feel like you needed? I know I, I was broke. I wanted to make some money. Broke. I wasn't making money. And so... But I had a problem with calling myself a coach. I mean, I was I was a mess. <laughs> I, was, 
I was a mess. I was like, baby, I don't even know if you want to work with me after this interview. I, 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 I don't know if you want. I was like, I don't know if you're gonna. You want to work with me? I, I'm just a mess. And so, uh, because I didn't want to. Seriously, I said I don't want people following me. I want them to follow Jesus. Why? Because I was so church. I was so. I'm an evangelist. You know, I was so church. I've been doing this since 2004, and I wanted people to go follow Jesus. Don't follow me. And so, <laughs> <laughs> and so it was just uh just amazing to just to see uh i just needed a, a, some alignment uh i okay. know, remember i mean i was just needed some alignment knowing gotcha. that i had powerful messages knowing that i was powerful in what god has called me to do but uh so bam said so when you get off the, what do you see yourself in five years i said i see myself in, in five years on on platforms uh giving powerful message, encouraging women uh, of faith to live their purpose journey. She said, okay, so when you get off that stage and you know, people run up to you and they want to work with you, what you going to tell them? And I was like, I don't know what I'm going to tell them, girl. What you, <laughs> you guys, like, I am the same way regard. Like, that's exactly how I spoke to share. I'm like, so once you get done talking and they want to continue the connection with you, what are they going to do? <laughs> So Sherry, did you move forward with me way back in the, two years ago? Did you move forward? I did not. Why not? Um, I my mind, my mindset, I hadn't shifted in my mind. Um, my my mouth was saying something, but my heart and my mouth wasn't not lining up. Uh, and so it, it wasn't until I think another year later. I did do it like a one on one with I did I think we we met for like two an hour or so. It was earlier and this year. I didn't have any I, money. I, Literally, I didn't have any money. And so I was like, I remember Beverly. Uh oh, yeah. and Sherry, Sherry no, chopping no, up a little bit. Did that one hour. Yes, you guys, let me know if you can still hear Sherry. I know it's chopping up a little bit. Let me know if you can still hear her. Okay, Sherry, it's, you're back now. So you were saying we did the one-on-one. -on -one. We actually did a one-on-one -on -one earlier this year. We did year. a one-on-one -on -one intensity call, and then I launched mm -hmm. a webinar, and the mm -hmm. people was paying, and, <laughs> and uh, a few people paid. And so Bev, like, um, did you hit your, your target number? I said, no, girl, but that's okay. You know, people did pay, da, da, da. She said, are you posting? I said, yeah, I'm showing up. She said, go back and look at uh, your last five uh Facebook. So she helped me to sh how she showed me how to show up on social media because you know I was posting but I wasn't showing up. Wow. Uh, so uh, you know I'm social butterfly but I, I just uh, wasn't showing up. So she showed me why I did not hit my target with my first webinar. So that was my first paid uh, my first paid event that I ever done and we did it on intensity call and she did it. We did it from start to finish how to do that. Okay. So you guys, a couple of things that Sherry said, and you guys, and I see some of you guys like, Oh my gosh, babe, I can't find you. Um, so I know that some of you guys are still finding your way into this particular live. So I'm glad you guys are finding us. And so a couple of things that Sherry said, so Sherry, tell me from the time that you initially contacted me two years ago, how much money did you make in your business at that point? Uh, zero dollars and zero cents. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, and that's the thing. And I know, um, oh, okay, let me, they said the comments are blocking. So let me remove. Can you see our faces now, Tiffany? There we go. Um, and so you guys, that, that was the thing. I need you guys to hear. I need you guys to hear what she said. I need you guys to hear what she said. Because some of you guys, you will hop on sales calls. Oh, okay, bam. Let me think about it. And then two years later, you're still in the same spot. You guys, when you say that and when you do that, just like Sherry said, that is nothing but fear. That is nothing but fear if you don't move forward. Because think about it. You sitting there thinking about it all this time is the reason why you're not moving forward now. So first of all, you need to remove that phrase out of your vocabulary. You need to remove it. Because you guys <laughs> always hear me say this. Like, you already prayed to God. He brought a solution to you, whether or not it's me or another coach. I don't care who the coach is. But he's brought you the solution. Mm -hmm. And then once again, you allow fear to kick in when it was time for you to make that decision to move forward. Mm -hmm. So Sherry told you. Sherry was like, I made zero dollars and zero cents <laughs> in that time. And so you guys, when you get sick and tired of being sick and tired, when you get tired of being sick and tired, you're going to make a change. You're going to make a change. And so you guys, that was it. So she, like I said, Sherry came back and you guys, 
I will reach out. And I say this to you guys all the time. Reach out to those people that you did sales calls with and they didn't move forward just to see where they are. And so I will do the same thing. I'll just reach out. You know, how are things going? Especially those people that say, let me think about it. Because I know, I know they're not going, I know they're not, nothing's going to change. Mm -hmm. Because think about it. If they could have done it on their own, they would have done it already. They would have done it already. Period. Period, period, period. So fast forward to this year, Sherry reaches back out to me. I said, oh, there goes Sherry. Sherry, she's back. Because like I said, we stayed in contact. I didn't disconnect from her because she chose not to move forward. I didn't do that. Because once again, I already knew. I knew something was going to happen. I just didn't know when. Because like I said, when I spoke to her, I'm like, oh, no, you're too powerful for your message not to be out there. You're too powerful for that. And so, yeah, so I just said, okay. So she came back, right, Sherry? You came back, and we did an intensive. Mm-hmm. <laughs> we did that. So she made a couple of dollars. But you guys, once again, a couple of dollars not going to get it. Because you guys, that big vision that Sherry had, where she saw her, that couple of dollars that she made from that webinar, or whatever, master class, whatever it was. But sometimes, you guys, you do need that little win sometimes. Sometimes you need that yeah. one like, okay, okay, I can do it. Okay, mm-hmm. so now, Sherry, fast forward. So now you reach back out to me again. And you guys, let me know if you can see me because I'm seeing somebody say they can't see you guys. Let us know if you can see us. I removed all the banners and everything. So I think we should be good. And so Sherry, fast forward. Now you're in the academy. So Sherry's like, okay, Bev, because uh, she came to me with a couple of different investment opportunities that she uh, that you saw. And you were like, Bev, uh, s- send me the link to the academy, right? <laughs> yeah. What, 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 what happened, Beverly, was what Beverly did not know was uh, I was led to leave my job without mm. a plan. I mean, I was, uh, I felt God prompted me to leave my job. But at this time, I'm in school, finishing up my bachelor's in Christian counseling. And so it was so crazy for about a month. The people on my job, like, which, you know, most of the time you leave a job, you already got, you got another job lined up. And so they would say, so Sherry, so uh, what you get ready to do? I said, go home. You know, I was like, I'm going home. I didn't have a plan. And it was so fun for, for a whole month. So they were like, I thought Memphis was, because I'm here in Memphis. I thought Memphis was your home. I'm like, yeah, I'm going to the house. So I said, I'm going to the house. And so I kept saying I'm going to the house. And of course, I did go to the house. And uh, my husband was in my ear like, so how long are you going to be at the house? And so <laughs> it's like, God told me to leave my job. <laughs> and, and it sounded so crazy, even to my spouse, because he didn't give me a plan, guys. Um, you know, he he did not give me a plan. Like Bev said, I had positioned myself. I, I had did that webinar. I said, okay, I, I think I can do this. And again, I'm still coaching for the free on the side. I'm still, I mean, I'm coaching. Let me tell y'all something. I'm coaching doctors because I'm in the medical field. I'm coaching doctors. I, I mean, like, and I'm like, wait a minute. They asked me all of this. They can afford to pay me. You know what I'm saying? They can afford to pay me. And so one day, this is really was a light bulb. One of my doctors said to me, how do you know? Now they don't even have to share the same faith that I think one of them was one of them a Muslim and one of them was a Buddhist, okay? And they could stand each other. But uh they were saying stuff like, How do you know what to say? You know, like how do you know how do you know what to say? And I was like, you know, God, Almighty God may show up through Jesus in there sometime. You know, I don't want to be <laughs> I don't want to be too. I don't want to be too crucified. So I, you know, I would throw Jesus up in there, and I said, so, you know, my mighty God, Jesus Christ, the one. You know, I would just do something real funny and real silly with him, not to make him feel uncomfortable. But I was like, I'm going to the house, and um, uh, you know, and things like that. And when one of them, this is one of them said to me one time, "Well, what are you going to do? All you know is the church." This oh. is the Muslim doctor tells me this, and so I'm like, okay, okay, I'm gonna show you know. So then I was like, wait a minute. Y'all sleeping on me. Wait mm-hmm. a minute. So I uh, came to the house, uh, got my little, you know, I took my little cheese down, took my little money. And so I said, I'm finna invest in this business. I'm finna invest in the culture. Cause my husband looked at me crazy because I don't have a, I don't have a plan. And so I reached out to Beverly. And when my money hit, I said, I knew my money was gonna hit on a certain day. It's like I was waiting on my taxes to hit. I knew my <laughs> money was gonna hit. And I knew that I wanted the academy. I knew what was best for me. For mm-hmm. me, I'm one of these learners that, you know, like I have to write stuff over and over again. And, you know, so that that academy was just perfect for me. I reached out to Beverly and said, I know, I think you had launched the 5K in five days. Mm-hmm. 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 I, said, uh, I needed something where I could self-pace because I know me. 
I'm, I'm, I do have a lot of uh, uh, irons on. Y'all know I do have a television show that I've been having hosting for three years. I am heavily involved uh, with my church, my local church. I, I mean, you know, I, I do wear red carpets events. So I needed something where I could go back and I can um, uh, look up and, you know, things like that. And so when my money hit, I'm like, baby, let's send that link. <laughs> <laughs> and that is so funny because she Yes, and that was funny because, yeah, when you did come to me, it was between the road to 5K and the academy. And Sherry was like, no. And you guys, and I say that all the time, like, invest where you are. Know what it is that you need right now in your business and know how you consume information. And that was key between for Sherry because the road to 5K is very fast paced. Like, we do a workshop on a Saturday, and then on that Monday, we're implementing boom, 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 boom. Like, that's how quickly. And Sherry was like, oh, no, uh-uh. Babe, you know, I love you, babe, but that's not me. Exactly. So you guys, that's why I always say, and the same thing, know your people. How do mm-hmm. your people consume information? information. That's so yes. important. And that's what she said. She said, Bev, send me the link. I said, okay. And Sherry put a little head down and she got to working in that academy. So mm-hmm. now, Sherry, let's fast forward up to, because this is what people are like, you know, they, they like that inspirational part, but they're like, Sherry, what did you do? Sherry, what did you do? So, Sherry, for you, first of all, what did you have to change about how you were showing up? Because you said one thing that triggered you was the the doctor that made the comment, you know, the only thing you can do is this. But what else kind of triggered you to make you step into the role that I am Sherry Self, you know, I am the purpose ambassador. I am this purpose coach. Like, what did you have to do internally to get into that space? Um, You know, I did a visionary retreat. So I did a visionary retreat at the beginning of March. And when I, these women was, they came to the visionary retreat and that really did something for me on the inside. Like, girl, do you, I mean, you know, to see people crying, to see transformation of what's going on because of the gift that God, you know, put in, in put inside of me to see that people will pay. They will stay all night and they will want to know. They want to pick your brain. They want to be in your space and they will pay to do that. Okay. Um, so that the beginning of March, I told Barry, okay, I'm doing this retreat. Da da da. Um, I, I didn't make a big, big, big profit off of it because front now like this is really huge to me. And so um, but I did I did not go in the red, which is really important because mind you, I don't have no job. I ain't had no other plan. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> so right after that, that really did something for me, Beverly, on the inside. And I said this to say, I said that when the teacher shows up, when the teacher is ready, the students will show up. When I tell you, it was like a light, an aha moment. I had taken notes in the, the academy. Uh, well, I remember when I got first got in the academy, I said, Bev, this thing is massive. Where should I begin? I'm like, what you, help, help a girl out. Help a sister out. Because this thing is so much. Where should I begin? And I just went back to the beginning. I was where I was and where I was at. Okay. So then people was making appointments with me. I'm like, so I'm texting them appointments. Yeah. And I'm writing in my book. I was like, Bev, I'm saying, look, Bev, I'm getting appointments. People want to get on this discovery call with me. And so da, da, da. And that was the first um that was the first class that I took in an academy to teach us how to book discovery calls. And uh, oh, like pause that. right there, pause right there, Sherry, because Sherry just said a lot. You guys, first and foremost, Sherry had to show up as that coach. You guys, I keep saying this, and Sherry made me tear up when she was mentioning the vision board party that she had because Sherry even said it. She was like, "Those people will find money for what it is." For those transformations, remember she said transformations, you guys, we are about transformations and that's the power that you need to step into. What transformation do I help people achieve? Because when you're bold in the transformations that you can help people achieve, it no longer, it's no longer about you anymore. So those of you those of you to get caught up in your feel, I don't want to show up today. Oh my goodness, I don't want to do this line. My background don't look, my hair not right, my shirt color, that's this shirt color, not my brand color. You're making it about you. When it's about those people that are out there that God has called you to serve. So the longer you continue to hide, the longer you continue to talk about what you don't have, the longer those women and those men are going to continue to sit in the hell that they've been sitting in for the past five years, 10 years. You guys, I keep saying this because it's true. 
So the longer you make it about yourself and what you don't have and what you can't do right now, the longer those people are going to continue to stir in their mess. So Sherry was like, wait a minute, wait a minute. I need to book some sales calls. So Sherry said, let me go into the library in this academy, pull this class off the shelf on how to book more sales calls because the class yeah. is in there. And it's Sherry hard. said, Sherry messed me. She said, babe, they booking calls. Babe, wait a minute, they booking calls. But Sherry, did you catch what you just said? You guys, I don't know if you caught what Sherry just said. Sherry said, when we first did our call two years ago, she had this vision of her being on stages. And then I said to her, I said, well, Sherry, what happens once you step down off that stage and people want to connect with you? Mm -hmm. Sherry just told us a story of how she did this vision board party. <laughs> and then once again, it was a what's next. Okay, I did this vision board party. I poured it to these people. What's next? What's did next? you make that connection, Sherry? Or was something you said two years ago? And it may not have been on the same scale that you envisioned two years ago, but that just came into fruition what you told me two years ago. Yes. And yes. so now it was like, okay, now how do I continue to serve these women? Like you saw these women that were hurting mm. during that vision board party. They wrote, they made the vision because we yes. know that scripture, write the vision and make it plain. And Sherry, I shared with someone because Sherry shared with me when they did the vision board party, they actually put scriptures yes. next to what it was that they desired. Exactly. So now you guys, she high, she's highlighted to these people, hey, this is the life that you envision. This is what you say that you want. You guys, and a lot of us leave people there. But Sherry was like, I'm going to show you how to get there. Mm -hmm. Right? Now, Sherry, did you have everything together? Beverly. <laughs> y'all know, see, y'all got to know my life. No, I didn't have everything together. It was crazy. It was so crazy, y'all, but I had so much fun. I tell people all the time, God get the glory out of my, my out of my life. I just had the fun doing this stuff. It was so crazy. I had nothing together. I mean, you, but people don't even know that you don't have it together. You guys, they don't even know that your stuff ain't even matching. They it, even know you, just one step ahead. You just have to be one step ahead of whoever you're helping. Now, Sherry, did I tell you to go run a Facebook ad? No. <laughs> Sherry, did I tell you to go set up a sales page? No. Sherry, do you have an email list yet? Did you start an email? <laughs> so you guys, all of this stuff that we feel like, Sherry, did you go out and, do, and get a webinar? Did you get a webinar platform? I don't even have a website. <laughs> hey, Sherry, Sherry, I didn't tell you this. I didn't tell you this, Sherry. I did not tell you this. Sherry, somebody asked me, because I told you guys, people hopped in my mind. When I shared this testimonial about uh, Sherry, the people that hopped in my inbox, so she, Sherry, somebody came to me and they said, you know, who's the person that, that did this $11,000? Well, you had already made a post in the group and this person is in the group. So I was like, you know, I said it was Sherry Self. She said, send me her website. <laughs> I said, if she has one, I don't even know what it is. If she has one, I don't know what it is. <laughs> you guys, we focus on the wrong things. Mm -hmm. Once again, I'm telling you for right now, those of you that have not started generating that revenue, like I said, if you can't call in, you know, I'm going to make $5,000 this month. I'm going to make $3,000 this month. Stop worrying about that. So you don't need that stuff. You don't need it. <laughs> Sherry just told you for herself. She doesn't have one. So don't go over there looking for www.sherry because she ain't got it. She don't have it. <laughs> it's gonna say error. It's gonna say not coming up. Yes, you will get a four. You will get a four four message. The, the page not there. She don't have it. <laughs> but you know what? I want to give a kudos and I want to thank God for my sister Amanda. I think it's Amanda. Uh, it's Amanda Brothers. Brothers. Uh huh. Okay. Amanda. God, she's in here. This is the week now. I'm telling y'all. This is how fast this happened. I'm trying to get this uh calendar schedule thing because you mind you i'm trying to do this scheduling and i'm going i'm getting exhausted trying to take people different schedules okay so i'm in the uh I, beverly is under the weather remember she had this ugly sinus infection and she's like i'm gonna get to you on monday i'm like no babe you cannot be sick this weekend because this momentum you know what i'm saying I, it's crazy how what stuff is happening so i didn't tell her all that i just said okay hope you feel better you know you know i just blessed her like okay okay i need somebody and so i thank god for amanda because uh she helped me with my scheduling uh, i said girl i what are these what are these questions at i mean like i'm like 
Y'all, I'm so new. And since I be telling Beverly, don't take me too fast, Beverly, because you know I'm new. I'm new coach. <laughs> um, mind you, two years ago, don't you call me no coach. So like, you know, I'm new to coaching. So uh, don't take me too fast. So it took it took uh, us all weekend from it took us that weekend. Amanda and I we worked. I mean, she really worked. I thank God for her life. I thank God and I pray everything back into her life. Amanda, thank you. God bless you. Uh, Cause Beverly was sick. And so <laughs> <laughs> I didn't have a okay. I the week before. Beverly said, "Yeah, you might need to get a schedule to share because that's what you know. You might need to start with this first. I didn't even get that thing together. I'm still working on it because I asked Beverly some questions. It's like, like, how to block off time? I mean, like, I don't have it together. I mean, I, mm-hmm. I'm like, I'm, I'm a work in progress. Mm-hmm. And so, mm-hmm. But get this, I'm working. Yes. And Sherry, because you said, yeah, you were like, because you were tired of being in your mess of not making money or not making the money that you desired to make, because she was bringing in something. It just wasn't to the level that's going to fund this vision that she has. You guys, we have to bring in the y'all. I'm just um, y'all. We got to bring it in the the money to the level that God has called, called us to show up. There's Amanda. There's Amanda there. Thank you, Amanda. So you guys, I'm telling you to start this coaching, you get a scheduler. Get a schedule, pay uh, acuity, calendar. Just get get a scheduler. Get those questions in there, mm-hmm. and you ask some pre-qualified questions. Have a way for people to pay you, and then have a way to conduct the call. So I recommend Zoom. I like Zoom um, because if you do it one on one, then it's free. So you know, most of you guys need to be starting off with one on ones anyways, and stop trying to jump to this coaching thing until you get a grasp on what it is your people need. So do one on one. Zoom is free if you're doing one on one. Do the one on one. I mm-hmm. also, I didn't, I, you know, I'm not even using Zoom. Uh, you just got to know where you are, baby. I'm doing yes. a free conference call. Yeah, that, yeah, that's what you guys, that's the other one too. Yes. I recommend Zoom because I like the video feature, but I also say free conference call is out there. It's audio. It allows you to record it yes. because you guys are coaches. You want to record the calls to yes. send to your people, but also for yourself for market research. She made it work for her. Mm-hmm. So, like I said, you guys, I wanted you to hear that part from Sherry as far as how low tech it is, because people will question me when I say you can generate ten thousand dollars in your business and be a month and be very low tech. So once again, your scheduler, a way to conduct the call, a way to collect your payment. Mm-hmm. I didn't tell Sherry to go do a sales page because Ther- Sherry probably would have fell out. Mm-hmm. I didn't. T- I'm like, does she have a website? I don't think Sherry has a website. And like I said. So Sherry, we get up there to this too. So, you know, you went, like I said, you guys, you don't have to do a webinar. What did you use to start getting yourself out there? What did you do? Facebook live uh, and uh, really texting everybody in my phone. I mean, like everybody that's scheduled with me, I, uh, you know, I'm picking up new people, new people mm-hmm. I follow in because of the, uh, I've been going live been very intentionally. Uh, one thing that I remember, this is another thing that triggers me to trigger me to show up on my birthday. Um, to get my photographer, he came in. I'm, I'm telling you, he makes me feel like a movie star. And so he took this picture of me, and I was standing in front of the venue. Y'all, this is a venue that uh, I went as always going. Never, I, and I, I, I said, I'm gonna do me an event here one day. It was an event. What, no, I'm going to back up real quick. I remember one day I was leaving the dollar store because you know I had zero dollars, zero cent. I left my job. I don't have a plan. And so. I did have this feeling of just, oh, my God. And I said to God, I said, God, people are not going to believe that I started this with zero dollar and zero cent. And I laughed to myself because I'm getting ready to book a venue. I don't even have the money, you guys, to even put on the down the deposit. I didn't even have it for the retreat. I didn't even have this money. You know, we zip lining and all kinds of crazy stuff, right? We facing our fears. I mean, like the, the, the retreat was crazy amazing. And so I want to do something to help them face their fear. And zip lining was one of them. And so it was just really, really powerful. And so I remember saying that, you know, I don't have no money. People not even gonna believe that I don't have any money. And so uh again, it it, it just don't, it just I just started with the people that I know. I, I had once I got the, the calendar that I said, hey, y'all, go schedule an appointment with me. I didn't even know I was going to talk to the people about on, on the call. So then I had to say, okay, now what I supposed to do? So then I go back into the academy because I remember Beverly saying, I said to Amanda, I said, girl, what a question that Beverly said we need to ask before, you know, doing the I said, what question? I said, so we in 
there digging. Y'all, we in the academy, Amanda and I, we digging for these questions. And uh, Amanda said, well, check this out. And I'm checking this out. I said, no, that ain't it. So I had to wait till the day it arrives. Barely get up. I put six days off. <laughs> And alcohol <laughs> wait till Monday morning. I was like, you know, talk to me, babe. I mean, like, these people are booking. I didn't even know what to tell them. I didn't even know questions to ask. And so she it told me about the implementation guide. I went to that. I got those questions. I catered it to what I wanted to say, the message of what I wanted to say. And that was my biggest, and I remember, that was my biggest, um, my biggest challenge for me was mm -hmm. the lingo like what do i say <clears throat> like how do i say what i do mm -hmm. I, I had the hardest time and i think that was the greatest spirit even from day zero talking with Barry. like i don't know what to say i don't know how to say what i what i feel what i you know like my mind and my mouth because i you know look you know what i'm saying i know when i get on stage i know it's all god it's not me because i'm not mm -hmm. that smart you know what i'm talking about <laughs> i'm not that smart and so uh <laughs> So I didn't know what to say, you guys. And so that's the great thing about being in the academy and having a coach. And one thing, you know, one, one thing Beverly always says that if you want somebody to spend $5,000 with you, you haven't spent $5,000 in anything. So here I go. Yeah, I remember that time I did that seminar. Over there. I was cracking like all the money mm -hmm. that I spent mm -hmm. trying to make me great, right? So the money that I spent with Beverly, the money I spent over here, the money, you know, and I said, I'll say, okay, you know what? I can charge that. I, I spent that. <laughs> I did it. I, uh, I, I was just, I'm worth it. And so yes. that's what I did. I got in there and, and I had these packages together. And they're still coming to, y'all. I put a mastermind class. I think I got two classes, two ideas already. Uh, but I, but you know what? I'm selling. I had God show mm -hmm. me ten women, and I'm selling right now. I think we, uh, we're at four women right now, and so we just launched this last week, Beverly. Remember? Yes. Uh, yes. So I mean, yes. like money in my bank account, deposit made. When we're gonna do the next the payment? You know. Okay, hold hold right there, Sherry, because you just said a lot. You guys, once again, I keep telling because I this is the part that I need you guys to lean in on. And some of you guys are not gonna like it. And I know right now it's telling me a 31 viewers on here, and this number probably gonna drop real fast. Some of you guys are looking for a magic bullet. How do I know? Because that was me. Remember, I told you guys I spent over seventy thousand dollars on all these courses. Somebody said, "Oh, you need to set up a YouTube channel to get clients." So I ran over there and set up a YouTube channel. Somebody said, "Oh, you need to be on Pinterest and stuff." So I ran over there and did this Pinterest course. Somebody said, "Oh, babe, you need to go ahead and do webinars." So I ran over here and did this webinar. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! You heard what Sherry said, you guys. I always say until you get a routine and a flow, and you're selling out programs. Stop throwing money at stuff and go for the people that are in your hot and your warm audience. Start there. So those of you that were looking for this magic bullet of, you know, Sherry says she ran this Facebook ad and all these leads came in. For, no, that's not what it is. Some of you guys are trying to, uh, you run around here talking about, I want to automate this and I want to automate, I want to put this on automation. I want to sell this in my sleep. You guys, you have to validate it first. Do people want it first? So you have to get out there in the trenches first. You have to talk to people. You have to figure out what it is that they need and how you, know, how you can serve them. And so that's why what I keep telling you guys, start with the people that you know. Mm -hmm. Start with the people, ask for referrals. Those of you that have done courses with me, I say the same thing, do the referrals, do those people that have been engaging with your content. Now, yes, I give you scripts to help you start those conversations because it does make it easier. But just like Sherry said, and I always say, I don't want you guys running around there sounding like little bibs. No, mm -hmm. sound like Sherry, sound like Letitia, sound like Tiffany, sound like Monique and Tammy and Amanda. You guys, you have to, it has to be about you and how God wired you to serve people. But you have to get started. Some of you guys, like I said, this is now, we're in April. You had all these big goals about what you're going to do in January. We are now in April. Have you made progress on that? Have you been generating revenue? Because like Sherry said, I was generating revenue, but not to the level that I wanted. Now, Sherry, we're going to we're gonna leave with this. We're going to end on this point right here or, or wind this up. Now, one thing, because once again, there are people running. Yeah, y'all heard that Sherry is newer to this. And so, Sherry, you know, we got the people out there because, you know, people in my inbox, I shared my story when I first started. I had my first group program 12 weeks for six ninety seven. dollars Bless me. The Lord has delivered me from foolishness. He has delivered <laughs> me from that because you guys, you had, like I said, although I may have been new on putting the title on me, I'm not new. I've been an entrepreneur since 2000. Thank you. We've been doing this forever. So, Sherry, 
I, you know, you have a package for five thousand. You have a five thousand dollar package. You have a three thousand dollar package as well, right? Do I have those two prices? You, do you guys hear that? Do you hear that? Do you hear that? Once again, it's a bunch of baloney. If there's coaches out there telling you that you have to start your course and it has to be ninety-seven dollars, that's a bunch of baloney. Sherry just told you she has a five thousand dollar program. She has a two thousand dollar program, and it was so funny when she was talking about the pricing. But you guys, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, you don't have to put a ninety-seven dollar offer, or a ninety-seven dollar price tag on an offer. Because Sherry, you mentioned that word transformation. Your people are looking for transformations, right? Yes. And so you guys, to get that transformational change, and in order for Sherry to show up in her full fabulous stuff, because the girl is fabulous, that girl is bad, and her full fabulous self, she can't show up for these people. They're paying her $97 to work with her for 12 months. Like, yeah, you, you're not going to pay me $97, and I'm supposed to, like, it does something to your energy. And you don't show up the way that you need to fully show up. Even on the call, it starts on the call. And mm -hmm. I, made, I, I put it out there on social media, y'all. I, I, put, I put a picture of me and I or sent it to Beverly first. I said, uh, yes. I love yes. that picture. I said, it's powerful. I said, I feel powerful. And this is the this is the mindset I had even at the retreat. I want to be fun because I love, if it ain't fun, it ain't me. So I said, mm -hmm. I want to be fun. But I want to be powerful. And not only that, I want to pour out everything that God gave to me. It starts on my, when you have people thanking you and crying on the call, I got to record it. You ain't got to believe me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. When they are crying on the discovery call, okay? And you know it is starting right there. Because let me tell you what, three people going to always be on every call of mine. I'm, faith, I'm a faith believer. I, I'm not just, I'm for real, okay? So uh, that's me, the caller, and Holy Spirit. Because every call I'm praying for, I'm, you know, I know Beverly said this too. If you don't want me to pray for you, then I'm not your client. I remember she said that the first time we was on the phone two years ago <laughs> because she know who she's called to. She calls the mm -hmm. women in faith, okay? And so am I. I'm called to the marketplace. I'm called to the women that's out there selling your paparazzi jewelry, selling your Mary Kay, selling your, whatever you're selling, I'm with you because what? Nobody is going to, everybody's not going to go to church. And if you're in the marketplace, we run into all kinds of people. And so guess what? You be the church. You let them see Jesus in you, okay? So that's why I'm, and I'm passionate about that. And so I'm passionate about us when we out there representing God, then we know who we are. But so my transformation, or to God be the glory, it is on the discovery call. It starts right there, you guys, because Holy Spirit is there. He's leading me. I'm saying, I'm praying. Sherry, Sherry let, me, let me pause you right there. You know, actually where it started, because I, I watched Sherry's live. That's where it starts. Like you guys remember your people, it starts even before they get on the call with you. So that's where that connection was. I've been on Sherry's lives and I'm like, look at that girl. She's being Sherry. Like she wasn't reading from some script. Once again, she may have seen some ideas, but once again, she said, I need to show up as Sherry because that's who the people want. So whatever your personality is, because I, I remember I was talking to one girl and she was just like, my coach told me I need to be more professional. And I need, I said, is that what you want to do? And she was like, no, no. I said, do you, y'all do you. So stop it. So yes, yeah, Sherry. So it actually started the Holy Spirit was with you even before that. Cause it was like, okay, Sherry, I need you to get out there in front of my people and let them know yeah. how you can serve them. And so go, I, I just wanted to pause you right there because I'm like, no, nah, the Thank Holy Spirit showed up way before that. But yeah, on that call, go ahead. Yeah, yeah and we just have to, you know, like Beverly said, um, show, up on her, show up every time. Beverly said, show up every time. And I put that out there, y'all. And I'm hashtagging that. I'm showing up every time. I'm bringing two things with me on every call. And we're in the store. We're doing one-on-one -on -one right there in the store. Supermarket, the ball game. I'm going to be fun, but I'm going to be powerful because I am representing the almighty God. And I'm showing up. And guess what? People want what we have. And they're going to pay for it. And I'm, I know we got to go, but quick, because I got to be shot for them. But, and I'm like, <laughs> this is how I am on my call, y'all. I'm yes. so transparent. And that's what, that's how transformation, that's what, if we real, we're trying to be this plastic, perfect, uh, get it together, all that. You know what I'm saying? If that was the case, I won't be on this call. Look at my head. I'm jacked up, okay? So, but I'm just saying, 
We just show up like you are and trust the process. Even when God told me to leave my job, he didn't show me the whole road, but he did show me a road to go now. And he's showing me along the way what I'm supposed to be doing and who the people I'm supposed to. So we're going to, you know, so we get on these discovery calls. One lady, the first thing she said, you know, I'm volunteering at my job, at my church. I said, okay. But at the end of the discovery call, because of the transformation that had taken place and what Holy Spirit was telling me and giving me insight on the things that she wasn't saying. So we got to be listening, like Bear, 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 just have Bear on my call. I won't go back and do her videos. And this is a, mm -hmm. So you can tell she's listening with her eyes. She's like, and so for real, I've been watching. I've, I've been, I've been really like, cause it's really working for me. Everything that she has said and everything she has laid out. I've been going, I'm like, okay, that's how she, she said, show up. Like that, I'm showing up like that. That's how Deb said. She said, "Reintroduce yourself." Okay, I'm putting my ass together today too. I'm reintroducing myself. Whatever she's saying to do, I'm doing, and I'm so grateful to God that He mm -hmm. has brought her in my life. Because I mean, you know, what I'm talking about. I mean, cause you know, what I love is that she love you where you are. She love you where you are, but she love you so much that you don't want. She don't want you to stay where you are. I love that about her. Uh, you know, I, I just love that about her. And so, you know, we on these calls and these people saying they don't have money, but by the end of the call, because transformation had already started, she's like, well, "We can, I can do that." I was okay, and I'm like, "Sorry, that's the bear. I ain't even waver." Yes, five thousand. You know, I have a fast action bonus. You want to take venture there today? Okay, girl, let's let's get started. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, baby, girl, I'm selling on that number. Uh, it ain't no, yeah, it's 5000 You want it? No, no. Yeah, she want it. Not only does she want it, but she need it. Boom. Right there, Sherry. And you guys, did you hear? And Sherry, you guys, I, I don't know if you pick up on this, the coach in me. First of all, Sherry came to me when she was in a place. She didn't have a job. Sherry came to me when she didn't have a job, but she invested because once again, she saw the vision that God had for her business. And so Sherry said, okay, babe, this is, and I tell you guys, and that's where you are. Yeah. Hey, Sherry said, babe, this is what I got right here. Almost like, babe, what you got? What you got? This is what I got. Hey. And from there, that's where she started from. And so because Sherry took that step of investing, even when she in the natural, because you know, look, we shouldn't even be operating in the natural anyway, but that's a whole nother story. But in the natural, things did not make sense for Sherry to invest when she did. She didn't have a job. Husband looking at her all sideways and crazy. But you know what? She realized that vision that God had for her. Once again, this whole step it out on faith thing. Yes. We, as believers, we keep hollering out. Faith is not worth the dead. Faith is not worth the dead. But we don't do anything about it. We yeah. talk about it, but we don't be about it. But Sherry said, you know what? Hey, I'm getting ready to go ahead and step out on this thing. And I'm going to do this investment. And Sherry, that's the reason why you're drawing the people into you. Because you did it yourself. You were like, I don't know. God showed me this step right here and I'm going to do this step right here. And that's the same thing with the people that you're drawing in to you because they're just like, well, I don't know the next step, but I know Sherry's going to help me get there. And they trust the process. They trust Sherry. And first of all, they trust the one that sent them and said, okay, God, I've been praying for this thing. You brought the solution. I just know the next step and I'm just going to take the next step. We are so caught up in trying to know all 15 steps down the road that we don't make a step at all. We don't do anything. And once again, look at where you are now compared to three months ago, compared to six months ago, compared to a year ago. Most of you guys are still in the same spot because you're afraid to move. What if I invest this money and it don't work out? What if I invest? What if, what if you do what God has told you to do? You pray to God to do. He brought you the solution. As believers, we, do we not believe he's going to carry us? Do we not believe that? So Sherry, that is why you're getting those people because you're showing up and you guys, I keep saying that, like you're showing up boldly. And so you're drawing in those people that are exhibiting the same characteristics that you exhibited. They, they're doing what you're doing. And so you guys, yes. And Marsha brought up a good point. It's not even just investing because that's what she said. Like Sherry didn't just invest and then say, okay, well, let me just let this sit on the shelf. No, she saw that vision. She's like, oh no, I got to invest and I have to implement. Those are the people that I love. Those are the people that I want to work with. Those people that are like, Bev, I don't know all the steps. This is what I got. I need you to help me the rest of the way mm -hmm. because I know she's going to implement. And that's exactly what she did. Like Sherry, she be in there. Cause like I said, I can track in my tracker, the, the platform that I can use. I can see what you guys, the progress that you make. I can see what you're doing in, in the academy. 
And so once again, she's getting the results because she's doing the work. It's not some magic bullet. It wasn't like I told her to push a button and all these people came. She did, hey, Bear said do this. Let me try that. I'm going to make it Sherry, but I'm going to do it. And then once again, that's when it started happening. That's when it started happening. It's not a magic bullet. It wasn't anything that Sherry just said, hey, okay, let me just push this button. No, she did it afraid, but she didn't. Yeah, I did it. So Sherry, to end this, I have one last question for you. What do you say to those people that are watching this either live or they're watching the replay right now and they're on the fence about work, uh, wanting to work with me? What do you say to them? Um, mm. <laughs> what to say? I would just say, um, you know, really, really, just to be honest, Beverly not paying me to say this. This is. <laughs> I would say Beverly is the truth. I mean, like the stuff that she teaches and the stuff, and she not only you know you have those people that that tell you do one thing and they do another. No, I'm watching her doing this right. I'm like, what she telling us to do? She's doing it the same thing. Uh, so I would say, you know, she is the truth. She is for real. And then she has a heart for God's people. She has a heart to see women succeed because sometimes some half of the stuff she's telling us, like, you know, like forever. I was in the group. I was in the, and I didn't leave. She didn't put me out because I, I didn't, do, my mind wasn't right. She didn't put me out. And guess what, you guys? I was still hitting up in the inbox. So, bear. No, I didn't spend no money with her, you know, but I would ask her questions and she was just, and she will, you know, and she would just be so willing and so loving and so kind and so sweet. And she said, well, try this. And we'll, we'll try this. We'll tweak this, Sherry. Uh, well, you know, like even before I, I spent the, the last investment with her. Uh, and so and you guys remember, and remember what I told you guys, a lot of the questions that come from the lunchtime coaches chats that we do in the group. Remember, I said, because people are in my messenger. So I'm like, let me just go ahead and do a lot. Like, I'm not that person. Let me hold this information back because they didn't pay me. So, no, like I said, I'm going to put it out there because my thing is, if you could have implemented it by that, you would have done it. Like you would have been making the revenue that you desire to make in your business. Yeah. And so I'm not that person to say, okay, I'm just going to share this part right there. You know, of course, I can't, I don't give everything away for free. But once again, 99%, 90% of whatever is there. Like, once again, I don't know how many times I told you guys, go out there and reach out to the people that are there in front of you, the people that are in your in your circle, in your sphere of influence. Reach out to those people. Grab those people. Now, like I said, yeah, I have scripts that can help you get those conversations started. Yeah. But you guys, I'm telling you, like you saw with Sherry, just do it. You guys, like I said, if it's not investing with me, invest with somebody. Because like I said, I'm not the coach for everybody because I'm going to call you out on your stuff. I really am. And once again, I'm not going to let you say, well, hey, these people not buying. Hey, these people. No, they are. Once again, Sherry used her current, uh, the people that were following her, the people that were you know, in her life. I told you guys offline and online. Who are those people that you can reach out to? Reach out to them. Reach out to them. Reach out to them. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, so stop being afraid because if you're afraid, you're making it about you and it's not about you. Not about us. And there we go. So Sherry, I want to thank you for coming on here. Once again, I wanted them to hear from you that there was not any behind the scenes. You know, Bear really had me run a Facebook ad or Bear had me set up a set. Go out there and share, so do www.sherrystuffifyouwanttocom and see what want to. Yeah, go out there and do it if you want to. See what happens. <laughs> but you guys, I'm telling you, Keep it basic. Keep it simple for right now until you get into that routine, until you get into that flow of making things happen. Some of you guys are trying to jump to step 10 when you need to do step one. When you need to do step one, you guys, I promise you, it works. What I teach works. Once again, I share with you my wins as well when it comes to financial wins. And once again, it wasn't me running. I remember the first coach I had, she kept telling me to run these ads, run these ads. Run. I'm like, this it's not working. It's not working. It's not working. Until I took a step back and it's like, get back to the basics, you guys. Some of you guys need to get solid on your basics first before you try to do some of that other stuff. Get solid first. And Sherry, I don't know if you can see these comments coming in. I don't know if you can see them, but like I said, sometimes we just need to have these conversations so that you guys can see what it's really like. First of all, to work with me, I'm crazy, but I love it. But like I said, I wanted you guys to see Sherry 
and to see her, she she invested where she was. That's what she did. She invested where she was because I'm not that person that's going to make you drag out and say, hey, go take out a second mortgage on your house to work. No, invest where you are. Now, even for Sherry, because of where she was, it was still a stretch for her. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's what she, she ain't had no job. She ain't had no job. But once again, she generated 11, over eleven thousand dollars in sales in four days, and she didn't have a job because once again, she took that step. She boldly said, "Bev, okay." And once again, because she said yes to herself, look at what started to happen. So those of you that are sitting on and allowing fear to keep you from moving forward, I challenge you. I really and truly challenge you to ask yourself, "Hey." If I just say yes to this and I just trust God to take this next step, what are the possibilities? What can happen? Could I be the next person that generates $11,000 in sales in four days? Because once again, God is not a respecter person. He's not a respecter no, person. So, hey, is I'm Sherry the favorite kid now, Beverly. You know I'm the favorite kid. In the favorite. We already had that argument because we already know I'm his favorite. So we already know I'm his favorite. <laughs> So you guys, like I said, Sherry, thank you so thank much you for joining us today. I really and truly appreciate it. Those yeah, of you, thank you. Those of you that are on the fence, once again, the Academy, that's for those of you that need that self-paced option. Those of you that need your first few thousand dollars in sales just to say, oh my gosh, I can do this. Oh my gosh, it's, it's possible. The Academy is for those of you. Once again, we're getting ready to do a class, a master class on Monday, this Monday at 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you can't make a vibe, it's going to be recorded. You have lifetime access to it. We're getting ready to do the live master class on how to do a launch, like the whole process and how I'm going to show you the, the, how I do a five figure launch. And like I said, I started off trying to sell something for six ninety seven, and nobody bought it. And then now my launches, when I do my big launches, I generate a minimum of thirty five thousand dollars on my minimum launches. And once wow. again, I'm telling you, so I'm going to show you guys what it is that I'm doing to do those types of launches. That's what I'm going to show. So those of you that need that, the academy, and once again, my academy is self-paced. So once again, you get the one masterclass a month, you're able to ask the questions. It's a little membership site in there, so you can ask the questions in there. So that's for the self-paced. That's for that coach is looking for that for the first few wins. And once again, Sherry was new to this. And, you know, so she's like, she needed those wins. She just didn't realize those wins was going to come at $11,000. But God, is <laughs> so yeah, so those of you that need those wins like that. Also, and um, um, Amanda, this is what you were referring to, too. Those of you that signed up with the Academy, I'm now bonusing in a strategic strategy plan. Because once again, I saw some people that were signed up for the Academy, but they didn't know what to do. Like Sherry said, there's so much information in there. So when I'm now uh, included a bonus, you get a one-on-one -on -one 60 minute call with me where we create your strategic plan so we can figure out what do we need to do to tackle this. And after this call, my goal is for you after that call is to go ahead and generate your next four figures in three days after that call. So those of you that signed up for the Academy, uh, you get that call. And Amanda, we're going to touch base and we're going to hook that call up with you too, Amanda. So those of you that signed up for the Academy, you can go ahead and get that strategic uh, strategy session as well. So if you're interested in the Academy, the the um, the the link is scrolling across the screen. I'll put it in the chat as well. I'll update this post and put it in the post as well. So those of you that are sitting on the fence, you guys, I'm telling you, the invest oh the investment for the Academy is only nine ninety seven. It is only only nine ninety seven, or you can do two payments of five fifty. So you can get started. Once again, for five hundred and fifty dollars, I can show we can do this uh, strategy session. I can show you how to generate your next four figures in three days. Let's get it done. But that is scrolling across the screen. Those of you that want to join, those of you that are like, Bev, I need more than I need more than self pace. I need you one on one. Then I have one on one as well. You can reach out to me about the one on one. We can go ahead and get that set up. My one on ones are for those people that are looking to generate their consistent five figure months. Those are my one on ones. So those of you that want the consistent five figure months. Let's hop on a call and see how we can get that done. Those of you that need to get your first few sales under your belt, then let's go ahead and get into the academy. It's scrolling across the screen. Once again, for an investment of less than $1,000, I'm going to show you how to generate at least four figures <laughs> in your business. And once again, you saw Sherry over there, my star, one of my star students over there in my academy. She did her $11,000 in a day. Yes. And I just want to say also, I am not even at home. I don't even have uh, half of my stuff with me. I'm out here. Uh, when God told me to leave my job, you know, I ain't got no job. So my one of my daughters said, Mom, I need some help. Can you come out here to help me? So I've been in my daughter's dorm room, y'all, for about uh, three weeks now, cramped up in one room, in her little room. So uh, it's crazy out here. And I can't even get uh, half a time. I can't even get internet. But I'm telling y'all, <laughs> uh, I'm trusting the process. Yes. And, uh, 
uh, making and, and, and doing it and doing it. I said, I ain't going to. They would have taken me to go leave home to make eleven thousand dollars in a week. I ain't coming back home. There you go. Thank you. But like, boo, come on, boo, come on, boo. Uh huh. Come on, boo. But you guys, you see. But I like what Sherry just said. Like, so, once again, you don't need all the bells and whistles. We're not even gonna tell you how what because how Sherry has her phone ring right now. We because she had to leave a tripod at home, but she made it work. She made it work. Some of you guys, like I said, you're worrying about the wrong thing. Yeah, I need to have this and I need to have that. No, you need to show up as you. Once again, make sure you have some of the basic when it comes to the business and then get on out there and serve your people. Point blank, period. Point blank, period. Do it, do it. So, yes, you guys, like I said, I would love to have you in the academy. Once again, those of you, um, I'm, reach, I'm gonna reach out to some of you guys because I feel like the academy would be a great uh, fit for you to get started. You don't wanna miss the live masterclass on Monday. Those of you that are looking for your next five-figure launch and how you do that, once again, it's gonna have the checklist. What do I do before I launch? What do I do in the middle of my launch? How do I open this cart? How do I close the cart? How do I do this? All of that stuff. We're gonna do all of that on the live masterclass on Monday. So if you want in to the academy let's go ahead and get you in that right there once again for less than four figures that's 997 or you can do two payments of 550 so you can technically get started for 550 dollars hop on this master this live master class on monday get your strategic planning session with bev as well let's go ahead and start generating this money you guys point blank period let's mm -hmm. do it let's do it let's do it so you guys, that is all that I have for you guys today. I see Tiffany has a dissertation up here on the screen. So I know the whole screen probably covered up with what Tiffany just said. Tiffany said, listen, I'm a full-time working mom of four. So don't think you have to leave your job to move forward with Beth. She coaches you personally. My business is transformed because of Beth. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Tiffany. I'm going to pay you after this. I got your money afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys, I pray that this was helpful. I pray that this released some of you guys, the stress of, oh my gosh, I have to have this. I have to have that. No, get started. The thing is you have to get started. That's what you have to do. Get started in what it was that God has called you to do. Get out there and serve his people, period, 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 period. So you guys, if you have any questions for me, hop in my messenger, ask me questions. Um, like I said, I will look Tiffany, Tiffany, I love you. And so you guys, like I said, go ahead and hop in my messenger. If you have questions, if you're ready to move forward on the Academy, the link is out there. You don't even have to hop in my messenger for, or you can hop in there and I'll send you the link, but my link is posted all over the place. I'm going to update the video and everything with the link as well. So you guys, that is all that we have. I didn't mean for this to go over an hour. Sherry said, how long? I said about 30 to 45 minutes. Oh. <laughs> I got to go, Bev. So you guys, that is all that I have. Like I said, I pray that this was helpful. You guys, you guys take care, take care, take care. Thank you. Thank you, Beverly. God bless you.